Hey guys, welcome back to more AFK Arena. In today's video, we are going to be doing some dragon summons. Now, unfortunately, you guys would have seen in my previous video, I was at my parents' house. I had my laptop, my other mic. For some reason, when I recorded my summon video on the main account, uh, the mic was just complete crackled mess and I couldn't use it. So we're doing it on my old test server account. I'd already done a few, so we do have a few summons saved, but I really want to show you guys the animations and stuff like that. So we've got 55 of the scrolls and we've got 44 of the gazers let's call them uh but we do already have on this account we got a few we did already get our copy of gwyneth which is absolutely wicked on my main account i did all the ones i had i didn't even get a copy of gwyneth from the gazing um and we do have you get a free copy of hildwin plus you do get more copies of hildwin as well through chests and i do think that for free to play uh going hildwin first may definitely be an option because the amount of free copies you get then stack that with doing the summons for him you can actually get him to a really high ascension pretty quick i'll work ex exactly how high and stuff like that uh in the future uh, before hopefully this drops on global but at the end of the day i'm a gwyneth man so i'm going for gwyneth regardless of what is the best thing to do as free to play so you know sometimes sometimes it, it just be like that sometimes it just be like that someone has a massive bow and they they're cool and you've just got to go with the character with the bow it's just the way it is i mean don't get me wrong hildwin is cool as well but you know gwyneth that was just a character I absolutely loved from when she came into the game. And I can't not get her dragon ball. It's just a thing. So let's go through. I want to show you guys about these summons. So first of all, we have the standard summons. As you do standard summons, you do get uh, these bad boys. Uh, and as you can see here, let's go through this. Dr Dr Draconis scrolls can be used to summon and obtain Draconis heroes. You can spend up to f you can spend 500 diamonds to perform one summon. So you can spend 5,000 diamonds for a temple on these things. It is quite expensive. Now, obviously, we do get the rare and common heroes as well in here the rares to use as food and the commons because they can't give us too much food and good stuff in the summons so you're going to give some trash that we've got to scrap it's just the way it is so that is that one when we go over here into these ones once again you can choose which character you can choose any of them and like i said you can even choose hildwin as well it's not like the eugene situation where you couldn't summon for him no hildwin you get a ton of free copies and you can summon for him. So that's a pretty interesting thing. Once again, I do think that's going to be the free-to-play way to go. But hey, Gwyneth's a thing and uh, I can't help it. It's, it's, just, it just, it's just who I am. All right. Uh, but with these ones, when we go to the info, you can use Draconis Insignias to summon and claim rewards such as Draconis Faction Heroes and Draconic emblems draconic emblems dude i'm struggling with all the uh, words here summons also have a chance of rewarding diamonds the prize pool contains uh draconic heroes chosen by the player so if we go to probabilities you can see here we've got gwyneth we've got a small chance at the thirty thousand. we've got some um upgrading materials and then we've got those ones uh which is their signature item materials and then we've got the resources those are the only things we can get in there that is what it is but Let's jump into the summons because the one thing I want to highlight is this is something I feel like AFK Arena was lacking for a long time. Like until we got, I think, I think it wasn't until we had time gazing that we actually got it, which is a summon animation that varies depending on the rarity of the thing you get. I think they should implement something like this into the standard summoning system because it just makes summoning more exciting to me. Now tell me if that's just stupidity from me, but I like a summon animation where something flashy happens and if you get something good, it happens. So let's do these summons. I'll show you slowly. And, and what we'll see, actually, the other thing is I'm going to put it on one time speed for these so we can, we can see it's super clean. Because uh, sometimes the animation cuts on uh, on higher speeds. So let's go over here to this. And let's go 10 pull. And just watch. So here we go. Where's my animation? Where's my summon animation? There was a purple flash. So I'm pretty sure we've got an elite in here. Maybe I, maybe I didn't see it right. Guys, where was my... Wait, I'm going to do five singles to try and make it... Yeah, okay, so this is the animation we get. And see how when it breaks, it does a flash, and that flash is blue? If that flash is purple, you get a purple. However, I did on my account get a... Um, a... Uh, a Hildwin in these pools because there is that probability, there is that chance. There's the 0.1% chance. I actually got it. And when it's doing this animation, you get all the yellow sparks in there and it's really cool. So let's just pop our five singles anyway to get rid of them. Uh, no, because I can use them into a 10. Uh, no, I can't use them into a 10 ball because unfortunately it doesn't let you just buy the rest out. 
So the flash is blue. That means it's going to be either a common or a rare. Once again, we'll do it again. Flash is blue, so it's a common or a rare. And then in the next 10 pool, maybe you'll see the flash being purple. So flash is blue, nothing. All right, let's go again. Uh, dude. Dude, you kidding me. You kidding me. All right, let's just buy some space. All right, let's go back. All right, here we go. So 10 pool, we're going to do it. Just watch. Boom, see how it was like the whole screen flooded with purple. That means we've got an elite. I know it may not sound like much, but it's something that gets me a little bit excited. See, there, there's our purple. Let's see. Okay, 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 Bubbles. Let's just, let's just call this character Bubbles. I'm, I'm just sticking to Bubbles. I can't help it. Uh, so that's cool. I like it. And if we go 10, it gives us the animation again. It doesn't cancel the animation. So that was a blue flash, which means we're getting nothing in these. Okay, now we're, now we're going to go again. Let's see. Blue flash means nothing, so we're guaranteed. From my testing, the limited testing I've done, we still do have the 30 guaranteed. So this should be a purple. See the purple flash? There we go. That means we get the purple. And it's the tank man. So now we can use 5,000 diamonds if we want to. And because we were degenerates, we're going to want to. And that was a blue flash, which means we got nothing. But once again, if you do, if you do land that, uh, what do they call them? They call them highborns, uh, which is either Gwyneth or um, Hildwin. If you get either of those two in the normal summons, it will give you like the yellow sparks and stuff, which I think is cool. I like summon animations. I'm sorry. I just do. All right, let's pop four singles first and then we'll see how we go. Dude, how am I? Them hero slots just absolutely killing me. The one thing I do like is that there's only one rare that you can get, which means you don't have to worry about foddering the wrong ones in auto in auto ascend, which is absolutely fantastic. All right, so let's go here. Let's do our four singles and then we'll do our temples. Once again, this one goes boom. We'll see. We'll we'll see. We, we hopefully we get the animation in forty two. Hopefully we can get the animation in forty two. Uh, I'm just going to skip the singles, though, because there's no chance we get it on the singles. All right. And th this is more like your time-gazing type animation, though. So this was expected, but the, the the scrolls having it, I really think they should add that effect to the normal scrolls in the game and the faction scrolls. I just think it's a good effect. Add something to the, um, the Stargazer as well, in my opinion. All right, let's go. Temple for Gwyneth. Okay, there it is. There it is. Straight in a temple. We got the gold one. You guys saw the difference. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. There it is. There's our Gwyneth. There's a double Gwyneth. No way. Triple? Surely not. Surely not. Okay. Listen. Listen, guys. I'll take it. I ain't going to complain about a double Gwyneth in a temple. That is insane. I'm already up to legendary plus Gwyneth now. See? See, don't go Hildwin. You'll just get Gwyneth rates. Just get Gwyneth rates. We we are we are gonna screenshot that. Thank you, Blue Stacks. And uh, <laughs> that one's going in the back. Nice. All right, let's go again. Let's go again. So it just, it's just purple there. Nothing. I don't know if there's a fake out. Like you get if you just get purple at the start, uh, and then if it can change. I'm not too sure. And I'm curious to see if there's anything bonus for thirty thousand diamonds. Once again, that's only purple. Not gonna get anything. Okay, I think we, I think I think we got we're onto our last temple. We're onto our last temple. Please, please. No, just purple. Yeah, I thought maybe like sometimes you might get a fake out where it, where it uh, turns yellow after it doesn't go yellow at the start. But that is basically what we are looking at. That is the summons. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's go over here. Can we auto ascend? Dude, I, I really wish they would let those things auto ascend, but I guess not. I guess it just ain't in the cards, eh? But there we go. We got the legendary plus Gwyneth from a double. Thank you very much. I will take it. Anyway, guys, that is going to be it. Like I said, I'm having fun with this dragon thing. I'm going to start a fresh account in a bit. I'm, I've got I've got a busy ass weekend and I'm flying to America uh, next week for a thing. So just for a couple of days, but at some stage, I'm going to start a fresh account and just grind through it because we get trials of all the characters. It's nuts. It's going to be insane. I just, I, I'm so jacked for it, but I'm also busy with AK Journey. Dude, things are busy. Anyway, I'm loving the dragons. Good is sick. Dude, everything's cool about dragons. I can't help it. I'm having too much fun. Anyway, as always, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you have an awesome day and I look forward to seeing the next one. Cheers.